If I remember correctly, he said that Konza is better than Varane and Douglas Luiz is better than Casemiro. Because just Keeban said, what's your thoughts on Gabby Bonglahor? Who basically, if I, if I remember correctly, we've not even got on the news yet, what a show. If I remember correctly, he said that Konza is better than Varane and Douglas Luiz is better than Casemiro. Well, I'll tell you, he does it on purpose, Lynn. He does it on purpose. He goes into work and thinks, what can I say to get loads of exposure that's a load of shit? Because if he genuinely believes that, he should be taken off air forever. I don't think he believes it. Because he does two or three a show. And I don't, you know, I, I work with talk sport. They don't give you that sort of stuff. I've never seen that. I've been at the studio. I've done countless shows with them. I've never heard in my ear say this, it'll, it's a load of shit and it'll wind people up. So I, I think he does it on purpose because at the end of the day he wins because we're talking about it and that viral, that clip's gone viral and ultimately that will pay his wages, won't it? You know, that, that'll be, Gabby, there's a new contract. So it's sad. The best thing to do is ignore it, but even I've been pulled into it now. It's, it's just a load of nonsense. It's, it's nonsense. I mean, I could do it now. Pretend like I'm doing it now. I genuinely think that Scott McTominay is a better player than Kevin De Bruyne. I don't care what anybody says. I think he is. I just think he's been a bit unlucky with he's not been given the game time he deserves. But you put Scott McTominay in that Man City team where De Bruyne is, he'll score 50 goals. He's better than De Bruyne. Now, it's complete nonsense. But, you know, you do that on there with that, you know, you see what I mean? 